Alright, and we're back, and hopefully things have stabilized a little bit. Looks like they have. So, as Professor Farnsworth would say, good news everybody! Or good news everyone! Shit, I don't have enough supplies at all to fuel my troops. You know, these bomber pilots just aren't flying in enough. I wonder how we got so many freaking anti- holy shit! Holy crap, those helicopters will mess us up if we're not careful. Like, they will really fucking take it, take it to us. I need some machine gun troops to help me hold the line in, against all odds. Yet. We're running out of troops fast. Oh, Jesus Christ, they are just merciless. They just keep on coming. There is no end. There is no end. Unfortunately, we're just halfway through this uh, horrible, horrible onslaught at this point. We got some machine gunners going up to hopefully able, be able to gun down some of King Alajar's infantry. Give him the good old what for. There we go. Good, 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 excellent. Although our fortress or readout is hurt pretty bad, so I'm gonna have to repair it. Save the day. Shock infantry are raiding up the anti enemy anti aircraft guns. Looks like we get a little bit of a lull, which is nice. Use it to build up some of my troops. Maybe uh, I can garrison some in the readout and they'll gain and they'll regain some health. And that'll be cool. I'll be able to kick some ass. Uh oh, here comes another wave of Halulim's, or, uh, uh Alajar, sorry, Alajar's forces. Including, uh, helicopter support. But we were able, but our anti-aircraft batteries were able to take them out fairly quickly. Shit, come on, do something, you goddamn anti-aircraft battery. Fire, fire before they take out all of our armor. Come on, fire, for the love of Christ! Okay, he did it. We're able to save it from an untimely death. Alright. Oh shit, now the tank goes down. Man, those helicopters just brutalized my my armor. Holy shit, my fortress is really going to town on my enemies. Only four minutes left of this brutal onslaught. I don't have many troops left either. But I think I'll be able to hold on. infantry ready to go at it. I think Alulum is preparing for his final assault. 
Or not Alulim. What am I saying? Who the hell's Alulim? Alajar. King Alajar. Brutal. This aircraft were just totally brutalized. It's just a death ride for these helicopter pilots. fucking wasteland raiders are they are just merciless they just keep coming and coming and coming and do not stop but unfortunately it doesn't matter because uh, we've got superior technology and Soviet will and it, and it will gun them down before they knew what hit them down he goes Another horde. Too late. Just wiped out. Uh, I can create a whole new armored fleet to drive against them. But it doesn't matter because there's only two minutes left. I don't think Alajar has the forces to uh, to drive us from here. We don't have that much troops left in all honesty. We've got four tanks and three shock infantries. They've only got a minute or a minute and 45 seconds to, to do this, to finish us off. I don't think they're going to do that. Oh, it looks like we got it in the back. Civilization will be restored soon. In another one minute and 15 seconds. We all have overthrown the new, the self-proclaimed King Alajar. And his helicopter fleet. His hordes of Asian infantry. Thirty seconds. It's almost over. Three, two, one, and zero. Whew. I kind of explain how this victory feels right now. I think this might explain it, though. Hey, I'll swallow your soul. I'll swallow your soul. I'll swallow your soul. <laughs> swallow this. Alright, welcome back guys to the uh, strategic map and we've retaken uh, Central Asia and I've rebuilt its territory strength so it's in a decent, it's in decent health. It's back in working order. And uh, move this guy over here. But uh, for that, for now, it looks like the Americans have also retaken the, uh, the west coast here. But for now, this is going to be it. Thank you guys for watching. It's Joseph, he's Ron Stalin, signing off for now. I hope you'll join me next time when uh, I think I'm just going to screw rebuilding my territories and I'm going to drive 
onward through Canada and then do to the Americans homeland in Washington and finish this war once and for all and bring peace back to the world. Anyway, see you guys later.